Now I will demonstrate how to insert ejector pin for this assembly. The tools is this one, design ejector pin. Okay. So now we can select which one should be insert, the left side or the right side. So the first thing I should do is to activate in which side I will insert the ejection pin and then just click this one. You can see in here. Okay. Now, if the display is not good, you can click a cancel, okay? And then you can use this one view uh, manager. Okay. You want to insert in this one? What you should do, you should do is click right click and then go to isolate because you want to insert the ejection pin into this one okay now you can see it's a lot easier okay I will insert the ME MM ejection pin in here ejection pin with sleeve SE so in here I will select this one you can see the preview in here and with a uh, pin catalog length maybe 350 but in here maybe I should find maybe 500 it's okay uh, the length is too long it's okay so because we're gonna trim this length and I'm gonna use also the catalog diameter about maybe six millimeters six millimeters and with catalog link about 500 okay now NX also in some cases have a uh, automatically search automatically search a uh, slip a position uh, so you can search automatically if I click this one search slip position NX will automatically select you can see this one okay so it will create five place like this with the symbol this one, this one and then I just click OK until now the 3d geometry for the ejector pin is not yet generated but only just the symbol in order to create this 3d model what you need to do is go to concept a design so this is the concept of design if I click we have five in here this one for example before you click apply uh, you should go to edit and see now as you can see it recommend that uh, the diameter is 5.2 so if you're using six uh, millimeters the diameter may be slightly uh, too big okay so NX will automatically uh, give a good recommendation so you just uh, accept this one and then click OK and you click apply NX automatically will create 3D model for this one you can see now you can see right in here the length is too long but it it's okay because we're going to use this one ejector pin post processing to trim this length for the rest you can see already maybe you can just click apply to create or just select all and then click apply okay after this you go to this one ejector pin post processing you select this at a trim you can see in here we have two types ejector and the pin this is the pin you select pin because this is what we want to uh, trim 
and then the tool for for trim is trim surface called trim sheet the trim sheet is the blue blue color this one for example if I click in here now you can see the length automatically is trim okay so you can get the length exactly as needed now I also want to add for the right side what I need to do now is to switch this one so the active part now is the right go back again same like on the left side okay we have to go to 5.2 as recommended 500 such slip position and it's automatically uh, looking for the slip position okay click ok and go back again to concept design I will check on the one okay no problem and then create all okay the next thing is to trim the length of the pin the ejection pin okay and then I click OK now we have for the both side the left and the right we have the ejection pin 